Good evening. I am back again with an update on an RE57, a Victor RE57. If you want to disable the recording situation that goes up to on the switch that's right here, up in one of these things, it's very simple to do. Um, this right here that I'm shining the light on, that there is your phonograph or your step-up transformer. Okay, it's got a four ohm about 4,000 ohm step up. All right, the 4,000 side hooks to the input of the phonograph. The the pickup head goes to the 4 ohm side because the pickup's 4 ohms, so it matches. Three to one transformer. Okay, better known as an equalizing transformer or an audio input transformer or microphone transformer. Anyways, um, I'm having to hold a light here because it's kind of dark and my camera don't work really good. But there is a, a black wire with a white tracer. You disconnect that. The white wire goes on lug four. Number one has a black wire, which is from the pickup, and then the ground can either fit on three or over on two. Uh, it's connected uh, between three, two, and then the case is a ground anyway. So it don't matter if you're on lug three with the ground or lug two. Okay. There's two wires right here. If you can see them. Uh, I clipped them off because they originally go down here to this thing. Okay, uh, there's a little strap on this thing. Originally, if you did not have the equipment on there, you could um, put the strap across, tighten both screws firmly, and that's what you do, and you don't have no feedback from the B plus or from the audio driver into this mess up here that sometimes shorts out and gives the interstage transformer a short life. Um, sometimes it can get confused and it can cause stress and you know you got a mess when you're playing with this switch up here that sometimes don't make a correct contact or if you just plainly got a bad wiring harness etc. Three wires on that, that there has to be hooked up and you're ready to go. You just disconnected this down here with the light shining on to take off a lot of the dangerous voltage that's coming up here. Anyways, um, that's my update on one of these. A lot of people don't tell you this stuff when they're working on them. Uh, I haven't seen anything out there about that. I do a lot of push and pull, 45 amplifiers, 71As, stuff like that. I build mono blocks and uh, I do a lot of these radio repairs too for my local friends and stuff that can talk me into it. Anyways, you guys have a good evening and that's your update. I won't tell you all of my secrets but I'll help you through it if you email me. If you're having a problem with one, I will see what I can do for you. Have a good evening.